Hello students. In our last session, we discussed about history of computer. Children, do you know how many generations are there in a computer? Today we will discuss about the generation of computer. Let's discuss how the modern computer evolved generation after generation. First generation of computer. The computers that were developed from 1946 to 1958 were called the first generation computers. The first generation computers used vacuum tubes. A vacuum tube consists of a glass bulb and wire. The wire is used to carry data in the form of electronic signals. The first generation computers were very large, expensive and required huge amount of electricity. The NES, Electronic Numerical Integrator and Calculator, was the first generation computer. The second generation computers were developed between 1959 to 1964. Now, what is the difference between first generation and the second generation computers? The second generation computers used transistors instead of vacuum tube. As transistors are smaller than vacuum tubes, the computer become much smaller in size it is also become faster and cheaper. Nineteen sixty five to nineteen seventy was the period of the third generation computers. Integrated circuit were introduced during the development of third generation of computer. An integrated circuit IC is a small as the transistor but it can work as fastest as thousands of them. Integrated circuits made computers faster, cheaper and smaller than the second generation computers. Nineteen seventy one to two thousand ten was the period of the fourth generation computers. The fourth generation computers use microprocessors. A microprocessor consists of a small silicon chip on which thousands of circuits are placed. The fourth generation computers are smaller, portable and cheaper. They use less electricity and produce less heat. The computers that are currently being researched and developed are 5th generation computers. These computers are the most advanced computers. Scientists are now trying to develop 5th generation computers in a way that they can think on their own. This is called artificial intelligence. So children, these are generations of computer. Now try to answer these questions. Thank you.